always there's more education to be done about what, why this food is important. Yes, it's a little bit more expensive, generally not that much more, sometimes not at all. But the amount of labor that take to get a plant to a fruit to a market um, without adding any chemicals or without hurting the, the land in any, you know, as much as possible and, and integrating it into a system that can, can continue for, for generations is really, the, the value of that is unfathomable even to me. And so to try, to try and explain how different that is from a, a different eggplant uh, that, that doesn't come from this system requires the work of, of everyone. But how would you tell someone, which is one of the things I have a hard time explaining to people when they, you know, balk it, well, I can get this at Acme for this. The, the difference is, like I've heard, the subsidies that large farms get versus the small farms are up against. So what are some of the economic realities that a small farm against versus some big ag farm? Mm -hmm. um, subsidies are, are, are a big thing. You know, we don't get any government assistance. We also, uh, you know, far, small farming is really capital intensive. It's really hard to do this without a lot of expense. We have to have a certain amount of equipment. We have to have a certain amount of input, healthy so soil, so compost, input. you know, um, organic fertilizers. And people are trying to think of new ways to keep their crops more protected with high tunnels and greenhouses. Right. And that costs a lot of money. And we're also small farm. We don't have the economies of scale that big farms do. So we try to get as efficient as possible, but labor is huge, definitely the biggest expense. And, and a lot of small farms are really, really trying to pay people a living wage. And that that's a big difference to people who are picking the horrible systems of people picking tomatoes in Florida that are doing it for, you know, a penny, a penny a tomato. So we're trying to make this system work not only for the the land and for right. the people who are eating the food, but also for the people who are working on the farm. And that costs a lot of money. And so trying to explain all of these different things that are going into the product that we are creating, uh, and a lot of it costs a lot more than, than on a big farm or on a commodity farm, or corn and soybeans right. requires no labor, and, right. you get, and it's protein that's going to animals. So that's a huge difference.